One of the proudest moments in my business career came as a result of being profiled in Black Enterprise Magazine. Now, I've been profiled in many magazines and publications over the years, but this one in particular was near and dear to my heart because it was like, as a kid, it was the only magazine I ever in my life subscribed to. You know, I work and earn my own money and that was the magazine I waited for every single month because I love the way they profile black and brown people who were doing their thing in corporate America as well as in the world of entrepreneurism. And, um, you know, a couple of years ago, I was, you know, hitting the track about to do a little workout, a little run, and I look and, you know, this, this guy was over there stretching, and I'm like, oh man, that looks like Earl Graves Sr. So I run past him like, yo, like, that's Earl Graves Sr., the founder of Black Enterprise. So I was a little nervous to approach him, so I did a lap and, you know, worked my courage up and I run on over to him and I'm like, hey, Mr. Graves, you have no idea how much you and your publication inspired me. Like, I'm just so happy to meet you. And, um, you know, he's smiling and I was like, yo, what a nice guy. And then I told him, I was like, you know, Yo, you, I've been profiled in your magazine. They did a feature story on my business. And the smile kind of left his face. He kind of got inquisitive all of a sudden. So he's a real nice guy, you know, just still talking and hearing me out. So I'm, you know, I was, after a while I just stopped talking. I was going a mile a minute and I was like, well, you know, I don't want to mess up the man's workout. So as I was leaving, he was like, um, who was your name again? And I was like, you know, Mr. Graves, it's me, it's Sean Prez. Very nice to meet you. So inspired by you. So I get done with the workout, I go, I sit down, take a breather, and um, you know, I'm about to take my shirt off because it's soaked, and I look, and my shirt says, no bitch assness. And I'm like, what? Are you kidding me? Of all of the shirts that I wore to the track today, I'm wearing a shirt that says, no bitch assness. So I'm sure when he asked me my name, he went back and lit somebody up like, who the hell put this guy in my magazine? We're profiling people, you know, who dress for success, and that ain't it. So I learned two very important lessons that day. Number one, you never get a second chance to make a first impression. And number two, you never know when opportunity is gonna present itself. So always carry yourself appropriately and dress the part. You are your own brand. Peace and love. Make every move a power move, and I'll catch you all on the next video. What's up, guys? Thanks for sticking with me to the end of the video. Truly appreciate you. If you like anything you heard here today, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And if you know anybody that can benefit from this message, feel free to share. Peace and love.